Hmm. I'm just going to wait a little bit for until people come in more. I, I really I really feel weird for being in this position. It kind of feels very weird, honestly. I got uh, go live. Uh, um, there we go. All right. Um. So yeah, he wants me to take it down. It's interesting. Feel free to ask away, I guess. Like why he wants me to take it down, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, it's just a live video. I don't know what's up, man. It's a YouTube video that predicted you would be here. I'm from the future. <laughs> Basically, um, the main reason, yeah, hello. The main reason the dog wants me to take it down is because, um, I didn't consult with him beforehand about that I was making this. Yes, the future. I didn't consult Doug that I was making this in the future, which led which led a number of errors to be present in the video. Nothing extremely major, I would say, but like he basically lines one hundred ten percent of it right, and as a result, it should be taken down. I mispronounce words. Um. I get one piece of uh, history backwards a little bit. It's that Gordon Cherry removed the uh, Lass's Trauma and, um, arrangements or publications after, not before, Doug's article's first article was released. Um, but, like, he, like, told me, like, oh, what, what words I mispronounced. It was, like, Liza instead of Lisa. It's yo, not yo. Um, it's caricature, not caricature. And at the end of the email, he said... It's like at the end of the email, he said, uh, do your research right. Um, and also hire a voice actor to narrate your videos. And I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> so essentially insulting me for not getting shit right. Same words, right? So, yeah. Um, what else? All right, what else? I got to look here. Um, he um, he said it, he says it doesn't cite his article enough. I mean, I mean, let me actually. All right, one second here. I need more screens, bro. <laughs> um, yeah, let me do this. He says his first order. So, he says it doesn't. I don't cite his video enough. I don't cite him enough. I mean, look, it's right there. Okay, it's right there. Doug Yeo's articles. Little things change this time. Um, he has a problem with me um, making money off of the videos, even though I cite his videos. It's like he has a problem with like the fact that I make ad revenue from the videos, and uh, he didn't make any money during his research. And I still cite him and all that. I learned a lot from that video. Yeah, it's and um and here's the other thing too. A Y five X is um yeah, Governor Pritzker. <laughs> um 
Their business will be Get balancing the, the budget and resetting its priorities. For the first time since 2001, the state is paying its bill for time. Bond Ratings Agency upgraded Illinois' credit rating. We are truly forging a new path for our great state. <laughs> I've seen that ad so much, so much. Oh my god, this is another one. What the fuck? Million. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Gotta go over these ads. My wife needs this so, surgery. Essentially, yeah, blackface and all that. Um, it's the same. essentially um, he's basically he wanted me to take it down because I didn't reach, I didn't consult him ahead of time because, and as a result of not doing so, the video was quote incomplete, and uh, like. It's yeah. It's sorry. I'm I'm trying to think here. I'm trying to speak right. It's incomplete. As a result, the information you presented is incomplete, and it could have been so much better. And I'm like, yeah, it could be better, but it's good enough. I mean, if you if if there isn't if there's more if there's more that you've learned since your article your original articles were posted a year and a half ago, why like why like a year and a half ago like why why haven't you why haven't you published anything since then why why is the only additional stuff you've learned been in like a um and a i don't know like conferences and like the ita journal for that matter i don't know really let's what else does it say here um yeah basically I mean, the thing is, like, if it's public information, and I can just take that information and make it into a video and cite sources, I mean, seriously, what's the big deal, honestly? that That's just that, really. I mean, I know... Okay. Uh, Nathaniel Oxford, sorry, I didn't read your message here sooner. I don't mind the words, but yeah, he probably wants his name pronounced right. He's a really cool guy. Very intense, though. I didn't know that. How, how do you know this guy? An amazing musicologist. And from the standpoint of, uh, like, no, like, he, this is a, prof this is his profession. Like, he is a professional historian. Like, he, he really does want 110% of things right. And, like, and it's like, that's not where I come from. And, like, it's like doing everything, everything, like, 100% right. Like, that takes years. Like, I, I'm not going to spend years doing this, Re researching for one video. I'm not, I'm not going to do that. I'd rather put out, like, a 10 minute shortened, uh, summarized version of something as opposed to like a two hour long, super long movie or something like that. It's like, I'm always, I'm like, I'll, I'll always do my best. And I'm, I know I'm not professional, but like, it's like, even then there, there's, there's the aspect of like good enough, you know? Hoop sock, what the hell? That was weird. No, it's like Doug yeah, is is a legitimately good person. I mean yeah, yeah. But like he um he deserves all the credit for his research and I and I give him the, and I give him that credit. I'm just making it into a video. That's all it is really. From the standpoint of making ad revenue off a of video about the trombone family is that different from making money off of performing or publishing the trombone family i don't know the answer let me read it again here i'm trying to understand your statements here from the standpoint of making ad revenue off of video about the trombone family is that different from making money off of performing or publishing the trombone family um well i'm, I'm not really sure how to can, can, is, is there someone who's can, maybe can paraphrase your question <clears throat> can you like maybe like say it in a different way because I'm, I'm having a trouble like understanding Sorry, I'm. My mind's been all over the place um, because of this situation I'm in right now. It's hard. It's hard for me to process things. Right, I do apologize, everyone, but thank you for stopping by. I really do appreciate it. I want to go live because I didn't want to just like put out a response video and then have people refute. I'm like, oh crap, I should have said that. Um, I want to just. I just want to discuss with you all. I just want to discuss with you all and just like say, hey, what do you guys think? Like, obviously, you guys will be biased and like, oh yeah, the trauma channel. I love the trauma channel. It's great. Uh, Doug Yeo can, no, I'm not, no, I mean, I'll be honest right now. Doug Yeo is a great, is very, very great historian. I'll, I can't, I'm, can't say that without, can't, I can't emphasize that enough. 
But like, for those of you tuning in right now, oversimplified version of why he wants me to take down the video. I didn't reach out to him in advance. Just even though, even though the information was already out there on the internet, and the video could have been 10,000 times better. Because there's more information out there now. There's this and that. And I'm like, great. Um, don't we, I mean, I was like, I really easily could have, um, Hey, Eli, you the, you the Eli Vorvik from the, uh, Christmas video. How's it going? How's it going, man? How's Iowa been? Or, or, or do you even look, go to college in Iowa? I don't know, man. Uh, the ones on the screen. Um, why would he say that? You just supported his message. That's the whole thing. And like, I didn't need to reach out to him to know what I'm reading. Like I can read and like, and these, and these are, it's like, these are your articles. And it's like, if your articles are not enough, then why wouldn't you put anything out then since then? He said, I, he's like, I have in conference in paid conferences and an IT and an article in the ITA journal. basically, basically, uh, we have an imposter manga. So, uh oh, you sussy baka. <laughs> My my understanding of why he wants my understanding um I my understanding is he wants everything one hundred ten thousand percent right and I get it but I don't want to spend years just getting it, getting it all right when it could be done in like a quarter or a fraction of the time you know what I mean guys it's different from reacting to stream to someone's video. It's different from reacting on stream to someone's video. That's that's the thing. I mean, I, I can't fucking think right. I mean, because well, that's the thing. It's like, I think I think what, I think my my way of paraphrasing, um, Eli, your your message is like, there's a reason I don't just narrate his. I mean, I do narrate like a ha like half of, a half of a paragraph he has in his article or something like that. It's also why I don't narrate the entire thing from start to finish, because. Because that would just be like, a, because that would just be like a ripoff or something like that. I mean, because at some point, like, you have to make the video like concise for people to understand it in a reasonable amount of time. Like, I'll I'll take this for example, my Malawi McDonald documentary, which you can watch by googling Malawi McDonald. Um, that video was forty eight minutes long. That that was a short version, forty eight minutes long. I originally intended that to be like two and two and a half hours plus long, or like as it was estimated to be longer or anything like that i can't do that all the time i can't even do 48 minute long, minute, minute long videos all the time and um and it's like as a result i shouldn't have to um hey spencer what's up man spencer what's up man how you doing how's your how your brother's doing how's uh how are your parents doing how's how's life what's going on man Anyway, you, you sidetracked me uh so any uh those of you watching spencer, spencer charge here is a good friend of my brother as a very good, very, very good friend of my brother, um, of my brother, basically, he's a cool guy. Um, so it's basically saying like, if your if your information is out there for free, and I can I can comprehend it and say, oh yeah, I can easily make this to a video. Here you go. Uh, I cite the I cite the dude. Um, I should be good to go because like there shouldn't be anything illegal about maybe miss maybe getting maybe like one or two things wrong. I mean. It can't be, he can't legally like say, oh, you got it wrong. I got to sue you for it. I don't know. Um, it took me a long, okay. So Nathaniel Oxford says, it took me a long time to wrap my head around Doug's article. At first I was like, no, that's a classic. Like, yeah, of course everyone was. And then all, and then all the, um, and then the aisle was divided into the MAGA hatters were here. The MAGA hatters were there. Um, um, that's a classic. I inferred that the issue was a publisher's editorial decision to add racist artwork on the cover. I mean, considering it's, I mean, let's, let, let's, let's consider the theoretical. If Henry Fillmore, if Henry, let's, let's say Henry Fillmore wasn't racist and he, and he defied racism and he, and he loved black people for, or for a reason. If he saw that on his own, if he saw an advertisement, he would have refuted, he would have taken, he would have, he could have spent, his, he had his entire life to refute that. He never, he, and he never chose to do that. And that's the worst part about it. Um, Hey, hey Eli, what you just said right there, you just defined my you just defined my YouTube channel. We also need abridged news because people don't have time to do a deep dive into stuff like that. And and that's and that's why because like 
And that's because, because like, you have to have shorter stuff and you have to have like, oh, if you want to read more into it, here you go. I'm just, I, I mean, sorry, I gotta keep reading here. Uh, Spencer Shart's here. Ugh. Sorry, excuse me. Um, no, we're all good, just chilling and stuff. That's great, man. Glad to hear. Life is really good. Getting ready to celebrate Grandpa's 90th birthday. Shout out to your grandpa. Um, Nathaniel Oxford, but I read it again a couple times and realized how deep it was. Your video definitely covered the various reasons why it was problematic. All right, I'm gonna switch back to just camera here. Yeah, I'm gonna put this over here. Um, um, uh, you, got, you guys are sending too many messages at once. <laughs> um, we also need bridge news. That is totally my point, Eli. I mean, and it's like I got sorry, sorry, time and all that. Um, but I read it again. I read it again a couple times. Don't feed the bank. It says the information was already out there. I don't see any reason for it to be taken down. And that that's the other thing too, because like. If it's out there, then like, do I need to reach out to this guy? Like, hey, can you, what does, what does the N word mean? Oh my God. It's so, no, it's like, I, I knew what I was looking at. It's like, I didn't, it's like, I want, I mean, it's always good to like, let people know, like in advance, like, Hey, I'm making this video. Maybe we can collaborate and all that. Like, but like for me, some, for me, sometimes it's like, oh, well, why bother if you can, if you can, if you already have the information right there. And it's like, well, if they're not releasing the, if, it's like, if there's more information out there that, um. It's like if there's no if if there's more more information that he has that he didn't release for whatever reason in the next year and a half, then like I, I guess that's on him for not doing that really. I mean, I mean, I, maybe sometimes you do or sometimes you don't collaborate with others. Uh, the information is already out there. I don't seem to take it down. I also liked your uh, special chart here. I also like your narration on your videos. Thank you very much, man. Uh, Tommy Urek. I mean, he has a point. You, you could have checked in with him and had a conversation about it and made sure interpretation of Doug's article was correct. Now you're in this situation. I, t I totally am in this situation. I, I totally know that. That's that's totally true, and that's why I'm freaking out right now. Um, yeah. Um, <clears throat> well, I mean, at the same time, it's like these are your articles, and if it's like these these are your articles, and if I have to learn this the hard way, which I which I'm all about, honestly, if I have to learn just I don't know if you learn things the hard way. I'll do. It. I'll, I'll. I'll learn it the hard way, really. Um. So Spencer, I just want to. Um. So. So, uh, Spencer, on your on the whole narration aspect, he does say mispronounce a number of words, including his last name. Um. Like, oh, it's caric. It's not caricature. It's car caricature. Caricature. Uh, it's not shouting Lisa. It's shouting Liza. It's not. Uh. It's not yo. It's yo. At the end of the article, at the end, of, at the at, no, at the end of the email he sent to me, he said, uh, and this 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 is kind of weird, honestly. At the end of the email, he said, um, please stop making videos until you understand how to research them, credit other people's work, and hire a voiceover actor to narrate them. I just found that insulting because, like, I think it's like. You help me. You you help me understand like oh, how to pronounce things, but then you go like oh well, you can't figure this shit out. You should hire a voice actor. <laughs> like what? <laughs> that was that was like pretty insulting. And I would say to him, well, 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 you teach a week in college, and um, no, I mean, at the same time, like if he's all about saying things right, then sure. Then sure. I mean, again, he's a perfectionist. He he wants everything done completely right, and that is t that is totally his choice to do so. He sh I sh I cannot hate him for doing that. That's great that he does these things. I just think like his level of, or degree of like pro professional professionalism and perfectionism is like through the roof. And great and great him for doing that. You know, um, care ik sure. <laughs> yeah, you know, so yeah, details do matter, and it's like. There's a fine line of like, but it it goes between like, oh um, re read everything from word for word and simplifying things, but don't oversimplify it to the point where it's like, oh, just don't play because that's racist and don't don't say why or anything like that. It's like certain certain information is key and it's like, I feel like I made I feel like I f I personally feel like I'm doing this well and all that. So, um, what do you guys think? I I'll, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask this one question. What do you guys think? Should I show the email on screen right now? Yes or no? I got 13 people watching. Should I show the email on screen? It's pretty, it's pretty, 
It's pretty long. All right, Dimitri says yes. It's it's a long video, so it's like a five minute read or something like that. I don't know. Um, show it, yes. Show are any anyone saying why I is there any reason why I should not right now? If he's really gonna throw a fit, you can point the arrows out in the video description or of taking it in the description of taking it down. If he's I don't really about words. Yes. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Here it comes. The bombshell email. Oh my god. <laughs> Here we go. All right, three, two, one. Here we go. I'm gonna read this. I'm gonna read. I'm just gonna read this out out loud. And and like, if you guys have a question, like, say it because I I, just, I I don't want to like you know come back to it and all that. Um. So I say. Uh. Okay. So first email is this. All right. I'm just gonna make sure it's on top here. All right. So I. So first I say. Uh, yeah, okay. My first name says, Doug, I hope you made the last of trauma article. Hope you like it. Why everyone stop playing last of trauma on me? Um, he basically said, uh, thank you. Can you guys read this? I think it should be. Can you guys read this? Can you guys read this? Is it good enough or? Just making sure. I won't read it until you guys say I can read it. Anyway, oh well. Yes, all right, cool. Thank you for your message. I was not able to view your video yesterday, but I just finished looking at it. Several friends have also told me about it as well. Uh, we did have correspondence in June and December 2020, and again in 2021. Um, hey, shall I be boys going on? Um, here are messages from you because you want your contact and plug. Okay. I basically, I basically said, I read your, so my, my email basically says, I read your email and I think we, I think it'd be pretty cool if I made a video, video about it or I can help, help make a video about it. And he, just, and he basically said, and I basically said like, oh, um, oh, that's not in here. And I basically said like, oh, so first I say, hey, these articles are really cool in the summer of 2020 when the last trauma articles were coming out. Maybe I can make a video video about it. And he's like, no, I got. And he's like, no, I got this. Thank you for offering to do so. So I said, yep, all right, fine, you can do it. A year and a half goes by. A year and a half goes by, and he didn't do it. And I'm just like, well, I guess I'll do it. <laughs> um, because I kind of assumed that he would make a some video about it, like in the next like week or month, maybe. But a year and a half, and that's just like, okay, come on, we gotta do something already. Um, all right, so here's the email. As you see in your message, you agreed not to make a video about my article, but you just did. While there are many good things about your video and you generally represent the situation well, there are several significant problems with your video that, if you had afforded me the courtesy of letting me know what you were, you were doing before you did it, it would have been different. It lists literally, a, a, literally everything possible. Okay. One. You even offered to help. Wow. Yeah. I, I, even, I, even, I even offered. I offered to help. I I would help him like a year and a half ago. Um, my last name is pronounced this. Uh, please refer to me as Douglas, not Doug. Um, I have a great more Dylan more on the subject. Um, great. Um, but that would have made my video longer. Your dispassionate voiceover does not sound engaging. Well, am I, well, what am I supposed to do? Sound sound happy and thrifty. Sound happy and not thrifty. Sound happy and cheerful about the N word in advertisements. I mean, what was what was I supposed to do? Breaking up the video with advertisements is distracting but it's part of the story. Well, well, am I not going to? I can't least for a video ads since we pop up ads in my video. Um, used a great deal of my own research about the only trauma glissandos and other subjects. And I one thing one thing that is fair is I don't say as Doug Yo has uncovered enough here. I guess that's fair a little bit. Um, I'm not really sure what that is. You, you get you guys you guys can um. You guys can uh, essentially throw in your um, thoughts and or, or anything like that. You mispronounced the word caricature as well as Lisa and not Liza. Gordon and this is a, this is an error right here. Gordon Cherry removed his publications after and not before. I want to see how many people are watching this over here. There we go. Nice ten people watching it. All right. Um, you used the two Navy band videos, interviews of me, interview of me, and performance of Western Sprout without providing links to the full videos. I mean, what the, f I mean, I, I put like at the bottom, first of all, it's one video. It's actually one video. 
and two, um, and two, um, what a <laughs> YouTuber with ads in the video, unacceptable. Ah! Oh wait, wait, nope, I got it, I got it. Hang on, hang on. I got this. I got. I got the best effect here. Hang on. I. I gotta get this up here. Oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry. One second here. I'm. I. This is. This is pretty good. This is pretty funny. Are you what? A YouTuber with ads in the video? Unacceptable. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I'm gonna keep. Sorry, I'm gonna keep this up here. All right, you allow comments, which allows for uninformed people to express their views that Fillmore's pieces were not racist. I would have preferred you not allow those comments. <laughs> <laughs> you did not tell viewers that I did not participate in the making of your video. <laughs> <laughs> As it stands, it would be easier to use to make that assumption. <laughs> it sounds like helpful people, but I'm in. But in an in an email format, it's hard to convey that. I think if he has concerns about being misquoted or his content being used, actually, those points to are all very valid, and they don't sound like attacks at all. They don't sound like attacks at all. Yeah, they're very valid. Um, and all okay, here's the second part. And all of this comments allowed for a video. Comments allowed for a video. <laughs> um, YouTube making a YouTuber making a YouTube video as a comment section. <laughs> oh my god! All right, all right, all right. I'm, I'm getting pretty warm right now. I'm laughing. I'm cracking up here. Um, I appreciate y'all stopping by. You guys, you guys are cool. Um, if and all of this, you are making money from viewer clicks on your video, be video because of the many advertisements in the video. I, who conducted nearly all the research for it, you are profiting and receiving no payment. Well, sh well, of sh well, of course I'm making money and you're not. Why don't you put ads in your blog or your website or whatever? If you had asked me, I, I would have told you that I still have plans to make my own video on the subject. Uh, Yeah, like you said, you were going to make it a year and a half ago now. Good God. And that I am now working on a major article on the subject for the International Trauma Association Journal. That's really cool, man. While I am always happy to learn that people are discussing this important issue, uh, I am not at all pleased with your appropriation of my research in ways that do not f f give that do not fully give credit to me for my work. Also, the several errors that you have made in your narrative and the other issues I mentioned above, especially mispronouncing my name, gravely disappoint me. Oh my god! Especially mispronouncing my name, gravely dis gravely disappoint me. <laughs> I, I need I need a I need a fucking soundboard. I mean seriously, I got all the vibes in here. Um, okay, all right. What does it say here? Oh shoot, this is too small. I gotta make it bigger, and large. Okay. All right, I got a okay. The impression I'm getting here is that he is a stuck-up jerk with a huge ego. He doesn't get to say stuff like that, and I believe you had the right to report on it after this amount of time. I'm going to read it again. The impression I'm getting here is that he that he is a stuck-up jerk with a huge ego. He doesn't get to say stuff like that, and I believe you had the right to report on it after this amount of time. I, 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 I agree with you, Eli, and also... um. Shout out to Eli for being one of, one of the trauma in my Christmas video last December. Yay. Um, no one made a video about it, and I was just like, well, why not me? And, like, the, the for him not to, and it's like, dude, get your shit done already. And I'm, and it's like, he needs to take his time doing stuff. He's busy. I don't know what I don't know what he's, what he's doing. We both happen. We we both. Uh, let me finish the email because I don't want I don't want to keep you, I don't want to keep you guys um around too long here. Um. Uh, okay. All of this could have been prevented if you had done the simple Curtis thing. Okay, this is this is this is where this is where I crossed the line. Uh, even getting down to being upset about mispronouncing his name. That reminds me of people who who say actually it's Doctor. Mm, I mean, I'm not Douglas, so I really can't I really can't say. But like, oh my God, you mispronounced Jack. It's not Jack or anything like that. I don't know. All this could have been prevented if you had done the simple Chris thing of letting me know you're preparing the video. No. 
I was a little late. Even though you had previously told me you would not be making the video, but you did not do that a year and a half plus ago. I wouldn't take any of it personally. Just sit on it and see if you can address each point and maybe get his help and input. You know, I did actually, and we're, we're going to get, I actually did reach out to him and I don't think that's possible at this point. I cannot compel you to move your video, but given how you represented my work, how you're profiting off of it and due to the many errors in your video, mispronunci mispronunciation, um, during trade release and publications after and not before, I cannot let the people know you're let people know that the video appears with my blessing. It doesn't. I am asking that you remove it because you do not represent you do not represent me in a good light. Re misrepresenting my um mis misrepresenting my name, not creating not crediting my research. It's in the fucking description. I mean, you, you, you guys can see it yourself, and the video does not adequately address this important issue. Well, if it, if 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 my video does if my video doesn't adequately address this important issue, then are then do your articles suck? Jack, you are a young man. I'm 25. Um, you have a lot to learn. Of course I do. But this is the second video you have made that has many problems. The other being your trauma and history video. That that's another that's a story for another day. That you do not reach out to others like me to help you with your videos to, so you can create credible, factually accurate representations. Um, is my is mind boggling to me. Um. I wouldn't take it in my personal. Demetrios, you also have the right to make your own video on the topic. He doesn't own the topic idea. That is the whole. Uh, that's the whole thing right there. That's that's the that's the whole point. It's it's not like I found this. Therefore, I own this conversation. Um, <laughs> what is your, what is your family gonna own the rights to, like the fact that stuff stuff happened a hundred years ago? I don't know, but like. The sound effects reading after reading a line is everything. Oh God! The sound effect after reading a line is everything. Jesus fucking Christ! I didn't even click it. Good luck. You did credit him though. I mean, that's the thing. I credit him like twelve thousand times. The fact you, is, you wouldn't even have a video without. The fact is, you wouldn't even have a video without his research. That's the thing too, because like, if he if he kept it to himself, no one would have known about this, and I would I wouldn't have been, been able. To, been able to make this video he what he could have done is just make the video first and the article at the same time so that i so that void maybe voiding my ability to actually make it because he already made one you know um yeah your video addressed the issue very well and he says he says because and, and i go back to thank you parker for the comment and i go back to um oh i, I need to be able to see what, what it look like here and I and I go back to now it's still here. Okay, go. Yeah, your video addressed the issue very well. And he goes back to if you if you didn't let me know for, if you if you let me know ahead of time that you were actually making this video. I'm gonna sorry sorry I do apologize. The text was behind the wall there. It's it's now it's fixed now. He's like oh because you didn't reach out to me it could have been much better more information. I'm like well do we need more information to defend your arguments? Are if your if your own articles are not enough why are we not posted more articles about the subject? You know. Um, okay. Even after our email exchange about your trauma history video, don't start for another day. You don't seem to have learned that's that important lesson. You are trying to position yourself as an informed researcher, researcher, but you are profiting from the work of others and you are producing videos that have incorrect and misleading information. Despite your good intentions with the video, I, the originator, I, the originator of the conversation about Fillmore's the trauma and family and its racially charged origins was not consulted. Your video could have been so much better, so much better. Instead, it is misleading and incomplete. What are your thoughts on that? I seem scared, bro. Um, no, I mean, no, it's 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 all it's all a little shocking. I'll I'll put it this way. Um, it's all a little shocking, to be honest. Um, I mean, I just I I never thought I'd have to defend myself over this, for over something like this, honestly. I, the originator. <laughs> yeah, that right there. I, oh, fuck. I, the originator. <laughs> <laughs> the originator. The, the originator of the conversation. They should, therefore, you should involve me for everything. Oh, my God. Um, in my opinion, you are not a researcher. You are a reporter. Mm, th that's that's actually a good point. Com that's actually a good comment, uh, Eli. And I, I do appreciate your participation in my comment section as well. In my opinion, I'm going to say it again, guys. In my, in, 
according to Eli right here, in my opinion, you are not a researcher. You are a reporter. That is totally the point here. That is absolutely the point here. That that's that's the whole thing. Um, I am disappointed in you, Jack. From I thought from our previous email conversation that you had learned some important lessons. He also told me to like you know spend one or two years reading history books, trauma and history books. Yeah, I'm not doing that. It's clear that you have not. Despite the large number of hits your video service has received, I ask that you remove it and have a long conversation with yourself before. Is it? Does it look right? Okay. I asked you have a long conversation about with yourself about before making more videos. In your new video, you asked what subjects do you should you should feature for future videos. Uh, I did actually do that. Please stop making videos until you understand how to research them, credit other people's work, and hire a voice actor to uh, narrate them. And I don't have the mind for them, unfortunately. But this is but this right here is quite insulting to me because like it's just, it's really hard for me to um narrate videos because like how I word things or how I say things, I always I'm always afraid that like, oh is, is someone gonna think think I sound like a jerk or something like that. Um, I I, just, I take offense to that because like it's essentially saying you can't speak right, therefore you should hire someone else to do it because you're 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 incapable. And that's that's kind of a pessimistic take, especially considering this man teaches at Wheaton Co Wheaton College, which is in Wheaton, Illinois, which is East, west of, west of, west of chicago so it's like if that if that's the best wheaton college has to offer then no wonder its students are fucked i don't know um you don't need a voice actor you do a great job thank you so much spicer i really appreciate that mostly of all i am disappointed that you have not sh you have shown you are not a person of your word you told me you would not make a video of my article then without telling me you made a video of my article Again, this was some. This was this. Okay, this right here. This was agreed. This was agreed upon a year, over a year and a half ago, June 29, twenty nine, twenty twenty. Right there. So, um, yeah. So, I read this, and the first thing I do is I, I talk about it with my friends then, and. I I have respect for him and his concerns and like what he what the issues he has. I unlisted the video as like a middle ground. So like if we did work together, I would delete it. Or if he or if we couldn't come to terms or something like that, I would um just make it public again. So I basically say here. So later, um I say um our report is completely valid, but it's clear we're both on completely opposite sides of the aisle. Uh, I live in Naperville, which is also west of Chicago, and you presumably presumably in Wheaton. Do you want to meet up in person, have a video recorded interview, so that we can get our set aside our differences, and I don't know, maybe get together or something like that? Um, the voice actor comment is shitty. Completely invalidates his points. I I agree with you a lot. Yeah, I agree. So I so I basically say, hey, do you want to um do you want to meet in person? Okay, yeah. Do you want to meet in person? Uh. And uh, I want to get this right and all that. And he says, thank you for delisting the video. I feel if if you feel all my quote points are valid and you quote completely understand my frustrations, then it is not possible for us to be on completely the size of the aisle. So I don't know what you mean by your statements. Missing from your email message was any kind of apology to me. I would be happy to continue a conversation with you about this, but I find your request for a recorded video meeting to be inappropriate. I'd welcome continued email conversation with you as you address the issues that I brought up. I am out of Illinois for a few weeks, so any kind of person meeting would have to wait for another time. I'm not interested in arguing with you. I wasn't I wasn't asking I wasn't talking about arguing with them. I was simply saying, hey, let's get together and like learn about each other, you know? Cause I have a I I love making history videos about the trombone. He loves writing articles about the history of the trombone. He has his own blog and all that. He 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 he's a very high figure in the trombone world. Basically, I never I never said I wanted to argue with him. Like that makes no sense, honestly. Anyway, and then and then I just kind of said, let's just you know what let's let's just make it public again. And then he and then he reached out to me and said, Jack, I see that you have made the video public again. Please remove it. I'm sure that you meant the video again. Please remove it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, so that's why I came here, guys. Um, I just want to um, uh, just go back to Gus camera here. So yeah, that that's why I want to um chat with you guys. Um, happy to take further questions, but all, all in all, I just find I find. 
I hate to say that he's a grump. Just uh, he. I mean, uh, let me just go back. Uh, yeah. I mean, what do you guys think? Do I keep it up or do I take it down? And on do I do I keep it up? Do I take it down? I I'm pretty sure you guys. I'm sure I'm pretty sure you guys know what the answer is. Honestly. If he's unwilling to meet up and settle your difference, I see no reason to remove it. If he's unwilling to meet up and settle your differences, I see no reason to remove it. I totally agree with that. Um, yeah. I, 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 I appeal to his concerns, and I'll, and I'll unlisted the video. But then when he said, I don't want to meet up in person, I don't want to argue with you. Um... Yeah, that for me that was just kind of like, okay, this guy's lost all faith in me. Yeah. Um Don't remove the video. It it's informative on the topic and it is a good video in general. Um I've had the most um the strong the person who who, who most strongly felt towards uh Doug Yeo probably in this conversation was Tommy Urick or something like that. But even then um he 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 throws some um I don't know facts or I guess like that. I'm I'm really tired. I'm I was, I've been thinking about this all day and like I wanted to um put together a response video, but I want to talk to, about to you guys first to like make sure like I wasn't crazy or anything like that because I knew I was ta I knew like I was talking about like oh one of the one of the leading trauma scholars in the world says I should not have history videos. <laughs> I'm like what. <laughs> unsubscribe this is so this is so cringe uh no oh, whatever too bad <laughs> uh whatever too bad i, I can that, that's unfortunate i the, the bottom line is i'd rather be myself than like um i'd rather be myself than a dead fish or something i don't know if you maybe i'm cringe maybe i'm not i don't know <laughs> um but yeah don't think about this too much just relax and ignore him yeah. So yeah, it's you know, it's just like what what was what was difficult about what was difficult about it was just like how I had this vision of like oh history video about that history video about that and all of a sudden first first time I make a history video and I cite this this guy's article immediately he's like take it down you did not involve me what the hell just happened what the hell is wrong with you hire a voice actor I don't know things like that and I was like well shit is this is this the end of my YouTube channel does that mean I can't do shit for free um. That that was just why I I freaked out so much basically, like I I I, I something else is I can't just pretend this this issue doesn't exist. Like I also I, I you guys deserve transparency and and that's what I'm giving you, and um I just want because like it's a very pivotal moment and like what what direction my channel can go in, you know, um oh, oh I still long what the hell to be featured in. Uh, just my face right now. Okay. Um, <laughs> Tommy just doesn't have the booms today. <laughs> Tommy should watch memes. <laughs> um, I haven't seen the video and just turn on the live stream. I say if the video doesn't have anything, anything horrible discrepancies that are misrepresented, then there is no reason to take it down. Um, there are, there's one thing I got wrong. I mean, there's a couple things I, I miss, I miss, I miss, I mispronounced some things. From some words, it's caricature and not it's not caricature and not caricature. It's Lee's Liza, not Lisa. Um, his last name is pronounced Yo instead of Yale, which I totally get. Um, and um, no, oh, what else? Shit. Yeah, the only thing I really did get wrong was the fact that Gordon Cherry removed the publications of Lost Trauma and after the first article, not before. And I, I, I got, I must, I must have. Must have messed that up sometime, really. Uh, time is just having the booms today. Pronouncing his name right wouldn't make me a dead fish. No, it wouldn't. No, it wouldn't. Are you are you considering? Are you considering possibly remaking the video if Dale doesn't want to meet up? Um, no, what I'm considering is just a uh, a video response, just like a. Not not like not like where I'm going live right now, just like a video response to Doug to my community and like what I'm doing moving forward basically. I just find it weird that someone who I know is a very smart guy and knows a lot about how this stuff works suddenly just doesn't like suddenly doesn't know how making videos on YouTube works. I don't know. Um is this like 
is this where I have the upper, upper ground or something like that? I don't know. I don't know really. Um, um, shit. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm definitely going to make a video response where I say, this is what happened. Um, I'm doing this for transparency's sake because you deserve to know what's going on. And I, and I can't just pretend this is, this, this isn't happening because at some point along the line, he's probably going to go on his, he, he's probably going to go on his blog and say, this guy, you should, y'all should cancel the trombone channel. <laughs> Don't watch his, any of his videos. They're misrepresentative. They're false. They're bullshit. Um, or I mean, <laughs> you know, I mean, because I don't want him to be the first one to say, oh, and I'm like, oh, my God, he's canceling me. I got to uncancel myself, you know. Um, actual reason wants down. I did not uh, consult with him ahead of time. Which, as a result, caused the video to be shorter, uh, not, have, not, have as much, not have as much information as there was in his original articles. Um, basically, yeah. I'll make a video about it like tomorrow or something like that, or I don't know when really. Um, but I do appreciate all of you defending me and, and knowing what the facts of the situation are and, you know, coming to reasonable conclusions here, which is nice. Um, maybe, maybe someone can um help him basically, because a lot of you have already been watching me the entire time. Really? <coughs> anyway, I'm really fucking warm. All right. Sorry. I'll be, I'll be back in like, Two seconds, gotta cool down my apartment. I'm back. <clears throat> anyway, um, so chat, what would you say is the main problem with the what would you say is the main problem with the video? Um, what I say is the main problem with the video. Um, the problems with the video are that I mispronounced some words. I got a, a small bit of a, a small bit of history backwards. Something happened before or after then, instead. Um, but his and I go back to like the the, the main reason he um, didn't like the video was I didn't consult him first. Essentially, saying there was there was no there is no scenario in which you not you not consult to me is something I can live with basically. Um, so. I'll, I guess I'll leave the, I guess I'll throw the email back up on screen here. Yeah. There, yeah, this is it. Uh, all of it, basically. I can, I can even just like, I can probably turn off my, my uh, video here just so you can see it all. Or actually what I can do is. Ooh, oh my God. He says, you must want to take down the video. Oh my God. Shit. All right, that that's the reason right there, guys. There it is. Hope you can hope you can read it. So, anything else you want to talk about, guys? They lift, you know, they lifted the mask mandate in the state of Illinois. I think about three weeks ago today, and I've been loving it. I mean, the communication that's like that's like a huge communication barrier. Um, For me, because I'm hard of hearing. I guess if we had to be picky like Doug Yale, yo, sorry. Um, I guess we could say two or three of the pronunciations were a bit funky, but other than that, the the, the video was pretty was pretty much accurate. Thanks, man. Appreciate appreciate it. Um, Oh, I just find it weird. I think of all the things that he said, one of the one of the things I find weird was that you did not you agreed not to make a video, but then you did. But that was like over that was like in the summer of twenty twenty, right when the articles were being released. And I'm like, well, 
I wasn't just going to let nothing happen, you know, like, well, sh I was, I wasn't gonna let nothing happen. Um, so like, I was just like, yeah, this guy's not doing it. <laughs> um, now that I see the whole video, it's really just sounds like an English ticker talking, taking the piss that you didn't make a perfect video with the high budget and a research team. Exactly. That's the whole thing. <laughs> Doug Yale wants the last is trauma video to be a Netflix, like a Netflix series or something. <laughs> I don't know the whole email. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think that was one weird thing too, is that he complains that I make ad revenue when he didn't make any money himself. And I'm like, well, if you're really going to complain about money, then maybe Wheaton college ain't paying you enough. <laughs> then maybe Wheaton college ain't paying you enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god it's so warm in here um yeah i'm actually i, I should probably keep this up actually um just like let people join in and all that i think that was another weird thing three is i mispronounced words so yo not yao or douglas not doug caricature instead of caricature liza instead of lisa and at the end of the article the the, the email he said uh where the fuck is it it moves all over uh here we go please stop making videos until you understand how to research them credit others people's work or credit other people's work and hire a voice actor to narrate them <laughs> uh Oh, I did, Eli, I never read this, actually. Keep it up. Don't bend to unreasonable BS. I deal with this in my band program all the time. Eli, if you're still around, um, what 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 exactly do you deal with in your band program? I hope, I hope it's still around. I don't know if he is. I, I, I messed his message like 10, 20 minutes ago or something like that. I don't know. Um, completely right, right over it. So... Oh, uh, this guy's a this guy's a perfectionist, obviously. Um, but yeah, I'll just leave this up here and kind of like answer any questions if you guys have any, really. But from from but for now, right now, um, but for now, like this is this essentially is like why, like I don't know why he wants the video down. It's mainly, and again, I'll say this again. I've said before. I'll say it again. It's mainly because I didn't cons consult with him beforehand, making the video much fucking better, or anything like that. I don't know. What if he's watching right now? <laughs> He'll be chatting like, "What the fuck are you doing?" <laughs> Imagine Doug Yo is like, "Jack, what the fuck are you doing here?" <laughs> I can't wait to watch myself play these vine boobs terribly with time, terribly timed or whatever. Uh, I also have this one. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, I was, I was thinking about making a response for it, but I figured I'd talk, talk about it, talk about it with you guys first. So. Yeah. I'm here. My band director is not very great. To keep it short, he's a very disorganized and can be really horrible as a person during rehearsal. Then he will victimize himself to justify his actions. Holy shit. I, I had a trauma. Okay, I'll, I'll briefly mention this. I had a trauma teacher out, out of college I attended. And some of my viewers, maybe not you guys specifically. I mean, that'd be crazy. Probably have come across him. He's in the Michigan area. Um, but like... I had, a, I had a trauma teacher and I didn't like him from day one and I tried to make it work out because I feel like I know their choice. And at the end of it all, he blamed me for everything, despite me and my family's best efforts to make it work out. Yeah. I wouldn't, but your band director, Eli, is much worse than that. <laughs> or, 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 or like if there was a, if there was a section of bad teachers, he, he, he was one of them basically. I don't know. So, I'm really fucking tired.
Lions. Yeah. Um, it's good to know that I was really afraid for the future of my YouTube channel because if I couldn't just you know, read other people's stuff um, and make videos, make videos about it. Um, I wish I could read my chat again. What the hell? Um, for instance, last week asked me to sight read an eighth grade band concert on tuba when a month later I had asked him for a music for this. He put me on the spot during rehearsal, asked me to do it. Oh shit. That's terrible, man. You got, uh, Eli, you got to run away. You got to run away from that band. You got to like just not do, honestly, you just not do band or seriously that that might just be why i do honestly because he's that bad apparently when i wanted the music he said it was easy and that i could not sight read it i shouldn't play tuba inferring i should not play the instrument oh shit that's that's terrible he's like blame my story so you suck you suck you suck and like if it's like if you happen to be good maybe he won't hit you i don't know i don't know i mean i'm hearing weird things i'm really sounds like that Eli, your band director, you can tell you tell tell your band director he's a sussy baka. I swear. <laughs> I want a fucking sombra where I can go. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Alright. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go soon now. Actually, um, been on here for almost an hour now. Tell him he's ultra sussy. True. Honestly, I would. He's a complete jackass. I don't know which is more fitting. Jackass or sussy baka. <laughs> just just put sussy baka on his ass or something. <laughs> Night, uh, Discord. Uh, by the way, join my, join my Discord server if you haven't already, guys. Shit, I, I should have I should set that sooner. Join my Discord server. It's in my link below. So hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate nice thumbnail. <laughs> um, sec. Staff. Someone in my service said, yeah, it's a little rude for him to say that. He could have just said to work on pronouncing things. I agree there, but I still think that making a video is going to work against what you want. Communicating with, via email with them would still be good. I mean, this this guy here, I'm, this guy here I'm referring to, he was, a music, he was a music ed major at a college. And, like, he essentially has to thrive on having those mutual connections. So, it, I think for that reason, that's why he's hesitant, basically. Um... Telling me it's ultra sussy. Um, honestly, I'll write it on the whiteboard. You have a dizzy, yo. I Discord. Is that what you called? Is that what you called Discord? A dizzy? Here, let me. Shit, let me do this. Yeah, I have a Discord. Right here. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that's my staff channel, obviously. Removed person. Wow. Oh, two people are already joining here. Hey, AY5X, what's going on here? A dizzy cord Gillespie? I don't I I don't know that shit. I'm, I'm I don't know that shit. I don't know that shit, is, guys. Um, I'm just I'm just leave this up here. Oh, oh. I'm being weird. <laughs> I'm a y five x by the way. Nice to meet. Nice to have you in my Discord server, Parker Hall. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate you, man. I can't wait until I hit ten thousand subs. I know I'm, I know I'm gonna get it before the summer. Um, which would be epic. I'm thinking about going to the Charmin Festival this year, actually. I think, I, I think like, of all the time right now, like, going to the Charmin Festival this year might happen, actually. And if I do go out, it will have to be, like, all four days. But, like, if I, um... 
it's like if I went to the festival like a two or three years ago, no one would recognize me. Maybe, maybe except for people I've heard, maybe except for people I saw on YouTube or something like that. But but since I'm like decently big on YouTube as far as trombone goes, like people would recommend people would recognize me then. At least some people would, I think. Um, and and then it's like because I've done so much on my YouTube channel, I might have I uh, some people might if I go to the trauma festival, some people might hate me actually. Um, and I'm like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Uh, some people might love me, love my videos and all that. Um, yeah. All right. All right. Uh, uh, last call for any last questions. Oh, and one more thing. Um, I said in my other video that I wasn't really too interested in being the best trombonist because I want to be this. Um, I might go to, I can't decide on whether to go because I'm 18. Can't do the youth workshop anymore. Oh, that sucks, dude. I've never done the youth workshop and I heard, I heard great things about it. Honestly, it's, it's like, if you're going to the ITF and you're, and you can go to the youth workshop, you, yeah, you gotta fucking go. You also save money that way. Um, I'm not too interested in, so like back to the doctor, to my topic is like, I'm not too interested in like being a good trombonist anymore really. Cause I have this YouTube channel where I, where I know I'm really, really successful at it. Um, so so like just like it's like I want to focus on this. So like I'm not gonna play with the Naperville Winds, which is a band I play for anymore. Um, so, all right. Any last minute questions? Because I think I'm gonna go by by nine o'clock basically. Any last questions? If you're just joining, just read uh, just read the email in front of you. That that's why. What what it doesn't say in the when, what it doesn't say um I did it once in 2019 my only complaint is that they swamped us with activities our days went from 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. oh my god really so like not enough downtime or something like that or like what would do you think do you think like with downtime they would then they would have had like activities like socialize and meet people and all that grab some digits ooh I don't know <laughs> um um oh, what was that gonna say i showed i don't know i am gonna it what what what, what it doesn't say in this email right in front of you is that when it when, when he says i'm not a man my word because i didn't agree to i agreed not to make the video when i actually did that was agreed a year and a half ago when the when the articles came out that was when that happened I think I really I really love chatting with you all today because like you all made me feel comfortable and and like made me feel comfortable saying like oh like you're not in the wrong he's he's the one who's crazy and all that he's the sussy baka <laughs> uh, uh. yeah great live stream have a have a great night man thank you so much Parker Hall for for being here and thank you for joining my Discord server thank you man. Man, I'm tired now. Um, I was like, we st we're still getting viewers. We're still getting people watching this and reading this, which is really cool. And now there's seven people watching. Good talking to you, man. Have yep. Have have a good one, Dimitrios Kolianos. Where are you from, Dimitrios? You from Greece or? Because you're from Greece, it's probably the middle of the night there or something. I don't know. Oh no, it's Eli's from Iowa, I think, yeah. Greece, sweet. What time is it there? It's like two in the morning or something, or because actually Demetrius, I've actually also I've actually also been to Greece. Um it was with a uh, travel study travel study program at Wisconsin Whitewater, the college I went to. Um It was cool. I hated that we were constantly going places. Which probably made us all sick of each other. Yeah. I mean, second me especially because I was a weirdo. I was a weirdo. <laughs> um, the I did another travel study program in study abroad program in Vienna, and that was fucking amazing. That was the fucking time of my life. Oh my god, I wish I could. I wish I could go back there with my friends again. That'd be epic. But it's all expensive as well. <laughs> oh, I actually, I'm in New Zealand now. Cool. 
I'm in Naperville, uh, west of Chicago, for like 30, 40 minutes west of Chicago. Um, so yeah. What's really weird about like videography jobs is even if you have a videography experience, like a 300 hours of videography experience during video production work in your high school, both colleges you attended, you, you, you have a, you have a capstone 48 minute long documentary. Uh, no one will fucking, no one will fucking take you. It's like, even for entry level jobs, you can't get shit in, in videography. It's, it's, it's annoying, honestly. Parker Hall, you follow me on Instagram? Whoa. Thanks for doing this. I've always been a pleasure to hang with you in streams. You are a great content creator, and I hope this Yale thing blows over quick for you. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. I think it will, I think it will, when it will really end is after I post the um, response video tomorrow. Um, yeah. Thanks for having me, Eli. <sighs> All right. I'm from Michigan, too. Where does it say that? Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, my dad grew up in Michigan, and we have a place in Michigan. Um, so, yeah. My dad works in Nashville, so the, my family travels to and from um um, Michigan and Nashville. Wait, are you in Discord? What the hell? All right. Um, I'm gonna. I hate. I hate. For everyone, for everyone who's still watching or just watching right now, I really hate that. Like, I don't know that I have to go. I mean, I'll, I'll leave this up. I'll leave, I'll leave this up. Um, I'll leave this up um, on YouTube for you for y'all to see if you guys want to see it. Um, and I'll probably include like a time code, so like, oh, when you read the email, skip to this moment or something like that. But in any case, thank you all guys for joining tonight and really thank you all for assuring me hey you're not you're not crazy he's crazy things like that basically and um for assuring me that hey we're not going anywhere you're you're in the right he's in the wrong um for 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 saying hey hire a voice actor to <laughs> narrate your videos oh my god i just i just find i just find that hilarious honestly but yeah, thank you all guys for um tuning in. I really do appreciate you. I got nine viewers. <laughs> oh my god, you got show up to nine congrats videos. Oh my god. <laughs> um it went down to eight. Yes. All right. You should go you should go back down to zero so I can end my stream. No. <laughs> um I, I I should I should live stream more often. You know what, guys, I, I feel bad. I should live stream more often. I'm I'm sorry if I haven't done that too often really. Um, because I do wanna connect with you i got nine thousand subscribers now that is so epic how about that and only eight people watching oh my god there's got nine thousand congrats viewers no <laughs> um but yeah um i just i just have to remind myself that because i have more viewers <laughs> because it's like because i have more viewers i'm gonna expect more more subscribers i'm gonna i'm, I'm gonna expect more um concurrent viewers on youtube now so essentially like i'll be guaranteed to have people watching now all right, everyone, have a good night, and I'll see you soon. Thanks.